This campaign allows you to send bulk personalized messages based on the user's profile data. Select the Send Messages campaign type and it will take you to the next page. The first thing you need to do is name your campaign and then you can start customizing it. Now you have to choose your campaign audience. Once you click on Source, it will drop down a few options you can choose from, and these are LinkedIn People Search Profile URLs List Group Members from Groups You Are Part Of on LinkedIn All of Your First Connections New Connections Other Campaigns Other Campaigns mean that you will select the exact same leads from another campaign you created in the past. Then you have people who commented on a LinkedIn post and last, people that reacted to a LinkedIn post. Make sure you select the option you would like here. Moving on, enabling manual review of profiles is completely up to you. For convenience purposes, we never mark them as required. That way, the campaign is going to be fully automated. If you decide to enable this option, the profile of the leads will be queued but Linked Automate will not perform any action until you manually approve the profiles. Next, you will see the option to start crafting your messages. You can add an introductory message and as many follow-up messages as you like. You can also set delays between each follow-up message. Remember that you can customize your messages as you want with our seven different variable options. And once you're done, simply click on save. Now you will have three options you can mark on or off depending on what you choose. The first option is don't send it to people who have conversed with. This means Linked Automate will skip the people on your campaign that you have previously had a conversation with. The second option should be enabled only if you enable the first option. For example, let's say you got or sent an invitation with a personalized note. This second option will basically tell Linked Automate to don't ignore your leads because of that first message. And if you enable the third option, it will ask Linked Automate to create a new LinkedIn conversation with your connection or lead if they respond to your message. If disabled, the system will try to find the existing conversation and if no conversation is found, it will create a new one. In the next step, you will see some restrictions you can customize. The first option you will see is to exclude members of other campaigns. In case you want to do that, you will first select the type of campaign you want to exclude and then select the name of the campaign. Next, you can exclude people from the campaign by adding specific keywords. If you wish to exclude people from the campaign, click on Add and then add the keywords you want to exclude. What will happen is that if someone from your campaign has these keywords on their LinkedIn profile, they will be automatically excluded and won't receive any messages from this campaign. This option is perfect when you are targeting a broader audience, like all of your first connections, new connections, people who commented on a LinkedIn post or group members. Remember that these two options I just mentioned are completely optional to fill out. Next, you will have to customize the limit of messages this campaign will send per day. And the last option is to set the delay between each message this campaign will send. This part is completely up to you. You can set a 30 second delay or 15 minutes between each message. Once you finish customizing your campaign, click Save Campaign, then go back to the Campaign Manager, turn it on, and your campaign will begin to work on all the actions you set up.